Hi, I'm Ashley Frizzell Cook, and I will be reading for Cassie. I don't know how I'm going to get through this night. They all know what's going on. They're your friends. Jesus, and you expect me to behave as if nothing is happening. Nothing is happening? What are you talking about? Don't you fucking lie to me. The whole goddamn city knows about you and that cheap little chippy bimbo. Hey, will you keep it down? Nothing's going on. You're blowing this up out of proportion. I hardly know this woman. She's on the Democratic Fundraising Committee. I met her and her husband two cocktail parties ago, for God's sake. Two cocktail parties, eh? Yes, two cocktail parties ago. You think I'm stupid? No. You think I'm blind? No. You think I don't know what's been going on? Yes, because you don't. Let me tell you something, Glenn. Are you listening? Don't you see my ears perking up? Mm. I've known about you and Carol Newman for over a year now. <laughs> Amazing. Since I only met her four months ago. Now I'm asking you to please lower your voice. That butler must be listening to everything. What do I care about a butler and a bleeding cook? My friends know about that bimbo. What do I care about domestic help? I don't know what's gotten in you, Cassie. Do my political ambitions bother you? Do you threaten somehow because I'm running for the Senate? State Senate. State Senate. Don't make it sound like we're going to Washington. We're going to Albany. 23 degrees below zero in the middle of winter, Albany. You're not Time's Man of the Year yet. Understand, honey? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. What was that? I said, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Oh, like I'm the one behaving badly, huh? I'm the shrew witch wife who's always hurting your feelings. Let me tell you something, Mr. State Senator. I'm not the only one who knows what's going on. People are talking. Trust me. What do you mean? You haven't said anything to anyone, have you? Is that what you're worried about? Your reputation, your career, your place in American history. You want to know what your place in American history will be? A commemorative stamp of you and that bimbo in some motel together. You are so hyper tonight, Cassie. You're out of control. You've been rubbing your quartz crystal again, haven't you? I've told you to throw those damn crystals away. They're dangerous. They're like perforated cocaine. Don't take it out, Cassie. Don't rub your crystal at the party. It makes you crazy. Put it away. Don't let my friends see what you're doing. Fine. Don't let my friends see what you're doing.